All right, so we're going to go and take a look at another example here of sketching a graph given various information of f prime and f double prime. Um, so we're going to sketch a graph of f on the interval from 0 to 2 again. Um, you know, you could have a different interval than that, obviously, but we're just doing the same one. And I've given you different uh, information about f prime and f double prime at various values of x. So it's the same idea as before, it's just I've set it up in a little different format. Okay? And I've told you also that f of 1 equals 2. So let's start with that again. I like to start with that. Let me go ahead and uh, draw on here my graph. So x equals 1, x equals 2. So, I know for this graph that at x equals 1, the y value is 2. So I'm going to put a point right there at the point 1, 2. I know my graph has to go through there, okay? So, I notice it says that f prime is positive in, for the x values in between 0 and 1. So in between 0 and 1, my graph is increasing. It has a positive slope since f prime is positive, okay? So I know that, you know, from x equals 0, and I don't know where I'm going to start on here. It doesn't matter where you start on here. I'm going to have a positive slope going up to that point right there. It's going to in, the graph of f is increasing since f prime is positive. And it also, you know, and then it says that at x equals 1, f prime is 0. Okay, so I know my graph is going to flatten out at 0, and I've got to take that into account when I draw my final graph. And then from 1 to 2, the x values, or during that uh, range of x values, f prime is positive as well. So it, you know, from 1 to 2, the f graph continues to increase. Now, I do know that at x equals 1, the slope is 0. So let me just indicate that. So when I do my final graph, I've got to make sure that at x equals 1, f prime is 0, or the slope is 0. So let's go down to f double prime. It says from 0 to 1, f double prime is negative. That means that the graph is concave down um, from 0 to 1. Okay, so I have a concave down graph from 0 to 1. So a graph that's increasing, but is downward facing. So a graph like that would look something like this, okay? And again, I want to draw it so it flattens out and has a slope of 0 at x equals 1. So you can see my graph increases in value, but has concave down, okay? And at x equals 1, has a slope of 0, clearly a slope of 0. Then I notice that f double prime is positive from x equals 1 to x equals 2. So my graph continues to increase, but now it changes concavity and is a positive concavity. All right. So you know, there's what it looks like. And again, you can see how I went all the way from 0 to 2. I, mean, I didn't stop before I got to either one of those. You have to make sure you go all the way. And I meet all the characteristics of this graph. Or of, this graph meets all the characteristics of the information I was given.